So I'm just going to go straight to the point on this video. Today's video is going to be me showing you how I use just my iPhone to edit my videos. Because basically, I use just one app. Let's get into the video, guys. I'm going to be telling you the app I use to edit my videos. Of course, it's like a very common app because a lot of YouTubers use it. I use iMovie to edit my videos. I'm just going to be showing you the basic things you can do on iMovie. This is what you are going to see when you open iMovie. It's just going to be your past videos and to start a new video just click on that plus thing click on movie just look for the video you want to edit and when you find it just click on it and tap on that check thing this is what it's going to look like you see different options when you tap on the movie so to split just tap on split right there you can reverse with this everything pointing back by the right to increase or reduce the speed you see this timer thing by the scissor so you can just tap on that you can drag it left to reduce the speed and drag it right to increase the speed to add your text on iMovie just click on that T by the bottom left corner and then just look for the font you want to use depending on how you want it to appear you can also add filters to your video, but personally, I feel like if you add filters to your video, it makes you look really unprofessional. On iMovie, it's also possible to reduce the sound of your video so you can add another sound. To add music, pictures, and videos, just tap on the plus thing by the left and scroll through to look for the picture or video you want to add. Now I'm going to be adding a sound, so I'm just going to pick, tap on soundtracks or music or sound effects and just pick anyone all of these musics are not copyrighted so you don't have the fear of getting copyrighted if you want to add music from apple music just tap on my music and look for the song you want to add so you can also add sound effects for all those weird sound effects all of them are here different sound effects you can add you can also add music from your iCloud Drive, so just scroll down and tap on iCloud Drive, search for the music you want to add to your video. Of course, you have the chance of getting copyrighted from using this music, but if you still want to use it, just go ahead and go to iCloud Drive. By tapping on that green line, then tapping on the scissors by the bottom left corner, you can split the music, you can increase the speed of the music. You can reduce the speed of the music you can do basically anything you can do to the video to the music when you are done with editing the video when you put your music you've done everything you want to do to the video just tap on done by the top left corner it's going to take you to another screen to save the video just tap on that icon in the middle down then scroll up and tap on save video then you can choose the quality you want to save your video i save my videos in 4k so it is very clear now that you know how to edit your videos uploading a video is not a hard thing you just have to open your normal youtube app and upload the video it's not hard the next thing you need to know how to do is edit your um channel art like some time ago youtube stopped um using like the normal youtube app to upload channel art and upload your display picture youtube said you have to use a laptop but there's a tiny little thing you can do to use your phone to to edit your channel so what you just have to do is open safari request a desktop site no let me just show you how to when you open your safari you type in youtube.com and browse the sites on safari not on the youtube app so you can do this on a normal site you have to request a desktop site by tapping on that ea thing near the search bar so you request the desktop site everything looks different on the desktop side there are more options and everything is kind of smaller so you have to zoom in a little to tap on your icon when you tap on your icon wait for it to load then you tap on your channel and then you take it to another site this is what your channel is going to look like on a desktop so you tap on customize channel to take you to another site and this is where you edit the channel at just tap on the channel at and then you see this pencil thing that pops up by the side so to edit the channel at just tap on edit channel at a normal channel at uses 
I think um, it just has to be like a full picture. That's going to be like a whole different video how to edit your channel art and how to edit your thumbnail and all that. If you want a video on how to edit your thumbnail or how to edit your channel art, not using the laptop either you just have to use your phone you just drop a comment down below just telling me if you want me to do like the thumbnail tutorial or the um channel art tutorial or just editing tutorial basically just wait for the next video this video was like a really highly requested video just i just have to do it i just have to show you guys how i do mine that i'm done with all those serious things all those explaining and trying to be smart things okay now let's get back to the real me what see when you watch that video like on my see, on my last videos i'll have like okay i'll get like 500 views 100 people will like the video you guys just like the video like the video and comment i told you if you don't have anything to write you you don't know what to write drop an emoji even though it's broken heart me like you're used to this girl you're used to fisayo you're not used to fisayo so thank you for watching this video you know what to do already so just do it like comment share and subscribe i'll see you next time in my next video stay tuned and